Hello guys welcome back to the channel i hope you all are doing extremely fine my name is prince and you are watching the tech stream in this video we are going to review the latest update of nothing os released for the nothing phone 1 so without wasting any more time let's get started it's been around a week since nothing rolled out the new update of stable nothing os for phone 1 and i've been using it on my device since the same time so in this video i am going to talk about the change log of this update whether there are any major improvements or not so i have my phone 1 running stable nothing os version 1 1.1.7 and if i go into the about info section you can see that the nothing os version is 1.1.7 and you have the updated security patch to november 1st 2022 if we talk about the benchmark scores on this build in geekbench the device scored 823 in single core and 2974 in multi core in cpu throttling test the cpu throttled up to 94% of its capacity without many dips in the graph the scores are a little lower than the last time but the benchmark scores alone don't tell you the story of real world use Now let's talk about what has been added by nothing in this build. The size of this build was around 79 MB, so don't expect any major additions. Talking about the change logs, first of all, the phone one now supports a battery percentage display for the AirPods. If we go into the experimental settings, you have the new option for the AirPods. I don't personally use AirPods, so can't really test this out. Next, the Android security patch has been updated to November 2022, which I've already shown you earlier in this video. The next change log is about the improved OS fluidity and reduced stutters and the phone one does feel quite smooth after this update the next change log says it adjusted the thermal threshold to better balance the performance and temperature which means the phone one will have less heating issues from now and honestly i have never faced any heating issues on this phone the thing has also improved the audio quality when recording videos it felt quite the same to me comment down if you felt any difference in the audio quality and i also did not feel any changes in the camera quality it is clicking almost the same quality as before and the last improvement is battery stats are now more accurate if we talk about bug fixes nothing has resolved an issue causing whatsapp notification to be unresponsive in the lock screen i am myself never faced that issue and there are some general bug fixes apart from this you can now toggle the wifi and mobile with just one tap on the quick settings using my device for this long with the 1.0 1.7 build i can say that the stability and performance of the device has improved a lot since nothing is providing quick updates for the same in general the bug fixes are also getting reduced and the device feels really good in day to day tasks that's all for this video comment down if you want an android 13 custom rom installation video on nothing phone 1 subscribe to the channel for more tech videos thank you for watching